Hello everyone! Welcome to I Love Math. In this video, we will talk about factoring using common monomial factor. Our objectives, we will find the greatest common monomial factor, then we will factor polynomials completely with common monomial factor. The greatest common monomial factor, it refers to the highest number. Ito yung highest number na makapag-divide doon sa dalawa or, tat or tatlong numbers. A common also factor with the greatest numerical factor and with variables having the least degree. So, number, pwede siyang number, numerical factor na makapag-divide, then meron siyang pinakamababa ang degree ng variable. Okay, for example, we will factor 6x squared and 15x to the 4th. What is the factors of 6? Pag sinabi natin factors, ito yung numbers na pag i-multiply mo, the result is 6. So, 6x squared, if factor natin dito ay ang 6 lang, ang 6 lang, kasi yung x, Yung variables, ang pinakamababa lang na degree ang kiting na natin. So, we will factor 6, 6. So, we have 3 times 2 times x squared. Then, we will factor 15x to the power of 4. So, pwede siyang 5 times 3 times x to the fourth. Now, titingnan natin ano yung... Uh, common sa kanila, number and a variable. So, ang common na number sa kanila ay 3. Then, pinakama variable na may pinakamababa ang exponent or the degree is x squared. So, ibig sabihin, our GCMF is 3x squared. So, tingnan mo yung, uh, tingnan mo yung 3x squared. 3x squared, pwede siyang makapag-divide sa 6x squared and pwede rin sa 15x to the power of 4. Yun yung sinasabi na greatest common monomial factor. Pwede number siya and variable or variable na makapag-divide dito sa dalawang term na at dalawang polynomials na. So, we will try to factor polynomials using the GCMF or the greatest common monomial factor. Okay, we will factor 6x plus 4x squared. Katulad ng ginawa natin kanina. Uh, we, we have step number 1, find the GCMF. Ginawa natin kanina. Pukunin muna natin yung greatest common monomial factor by factoring the two terms. 6x and 4x squared. So, factors ng 6x are uh, 2 times 3 times x. Factors ng 4x squared are 2 times 2 times x squared. Then, punin natin yung common number nila. And that is 2. Then, x yung pinakamababa ang exponent or the degree. So, our GCMF is 2x, which is makapag-divide siya sa 6x and 4x squared, right? So, GCMF natin is 2x. Next, we'll proceed to uh, step number 2, which is divide its term by its GCMF. Etong dalawang term natin or uh, etong polynomials natin, i-divide natin sa 2x. Okay, by each term, so isa-isa. First term muna tayo, 2x, divide, 6x divided by 2x. 6x divided by 2x is equal to 3. Plus, 4x squared divided by 2x. So, ibig sabihin, uh, x na lang. Kasi to x, uh, x squared divided by x is x na lang. So, 4 divided by 2 is 2, so the answer is plus 2x. Then, the third step, 
combine step 1 and 2 as a product. Ito yung step 1 natin, which is the 2x. Then, step 2 is 3 plus 2x. So, ikakombine lang natin as a product. So, the result is 2x times 3 plus 2x. So, ito na ngayon ang factored form natin. Factored form ng 6x plus 4x squared. Another example. Okay, 12a squared plus 18a. If a factor natin, una, find the GCMF. Okay, 12a squared is 2 times 6 times a squared. Next is 18a, 6 times 3 times 8, the a. Then, common nila is 6 and a. So, GCMF is 6a. Then, next step, divide natin by its uh, GCMF. Divided by 6a. 12a squared divided by 6a is equals to 2a. Then, 18a divided by 6a is equal to plus 3. Then, combine uh, step number 1 and step number 2. Uh, as a product, so the answer is 6a times 2a plus 3. Okay, next, 10x squared plus 25x plus 5. If a factor natin sila, factors of 10x squared is 5 times 2 times x squared. Factors of 25x is 5 times 5 times x. Then 5 is 5 times 1. So, common number is 5. Then, variables ay wala. Kasi yung 5 natin, uh, wala siyang variable. So, wala, hindi walang common sa kanilang tatlo. Kailangan sa silang tatlo meron. So, our GCMF is number 5. Then, divide the given polynomials by its uh, GCMF. So, divided by 5. 10x squared divided by 5 is 2x squared. 25x divided by 5 is equal to 5x. Then 5 divided by 5 is 1. Then combine step 1 and step 2 as a product. So 5 times 2x squared plus 5x plus 1. x to the power of 4, y cubed, minus 8xy squared, plus 12x squared, y. So, walang coefficient ang first term natin. Second meron, third meron. So, walang common sa kanila ang coefficient. So, diretso tayo sa variables. Anong common na variable sa kanila? Merong x, pareho silang may x, pareho silang may y. So, our... GCMF is X and Y. Ito yung pinakababa ang degree. So, yun uh, X, Y yung GCMF natin. We will divide the given polynomials by our GCMF, which is the X, Y. So, X to the power of 4, Y cube divided by X, Y is equal to X to the power of cube, Y squared na lang. Then, 8, negative 8xy squared divided by xy is negative 8y na lang natira. Kasi x wala na, 1 na lang yan. Then, plus 12x squared y divided by xy is equals to 12x. Combine step 1 and 2. And the answer is xy times x cubed y squared minus 8y plus 12x. Last example, 12x cubed minus 16x to the power of 6. Uh, factors na 12. 3 times 4 times x to the power of uh, 3. Then, 16 is 4 times 4 to the power of 6. Common number is 4. Then, the variable is 
3. So, our GCMF is 4x cubed. Divide its term by its GCMF, which is the 4x cubed. 12x cubed divided by 4x cubed is equal to 3 na lang. Minus 16x to the power of 6 divided by 4x cubed is equal to 4x cubed. So, 3 minus 4x cubed. Combine and the answer is 4x cubed times 3 minus 4x cubed. And that's it. Sana may, man, may natutunan kayo. Thank you until the next video natin. Uh, please don't forget to, subs to like and subscribe para ma-notify kayo sa susunod ng mga video na gagawin natin. Thank you and bye-bye.